7th of Safar. On this day in the year 128 AH, our 7th Imam Musa bin Ja'far was born in Abwa, a village between Mecca and Medina. Musa bin Ja'far was born in the period of the transfer of the power from the Umayyads to the Abbasids. When he was four years old, the first Abbasid Khalif took over the power. According to the hadith cited in Manaqib, he anonymously entered a village in Syria and had a dialogue with a priest there. The dialogue led to the conversion of the priest and his companions to Islam. There are reports of the Imam's trips to Mecca for Hajj or Umrah pilgrimages. The Imam السلام, was repeatedly summoned by the Abbasid Caliphs to Baghdad. Other than these occasions, he spent most of his life in Medina. Many hadith have been transmitted from Imam al Kadhim in Shiite collections of hadith. They are mostly concerned with theological issues such as monotheism, bida' and faith, as well as moral issues. Some supplications such as Joshan al-Kabir have also been transmitted from him. In the chains of the transmitters of such hadith, the Imam has been referred to as Al-Kadhim, Abu al-Hasan, Abu al-Hasan al-Awwal, Al-Alim and Al-Abd al-Salih. During his Imamat, Imam al-Kadhim السلام, was repeatedly summoned and imprisoned by Abbasid Khalifs. For the first time, he was taken from Medina to Baghdad at the command of the Abbasid Khalif Al-Mahdi Al-Abbasi. Harun had also imprisoned the Imam two times. After his father Imam Ja'far al-Sadiq was martyred, he became the Imam of the Shia. The 35 years of his Imama coincided with the Khalifa of Al-Mansur, Al-Hadi, Al-Mahdi and Harun. He was repeatedly imprisoned by Al-Mahdi and Harun. 